guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Adrian. So today's video is going to be a hair review. First off, let me say I'm so happy to be back to YouTube. I missed it. Um, I took a little break uh, for the holidays. I told you guys that I was going to be back in January, which it is still January, but I took a little time off. But I am back. I'm back with another video. So um, today we're gonna be talking about Happy New Year. Okay, first of all, Happy New Year. When I talk about Happy, we're not gonna talk about Happy New Year. I just wanted to say that, throw that out there, even though you know it's like January 26 or something like that. But still want to acknowledge it's Happy New Year, 2020, big things to come this year. Oh, can we talk about my new setup too, please? My husband did this one for Christmas. He, I got a whole new setup, my white wall, my plants my decor, my mirror. My sister helped me pick out all the stuff. So I am so excited. This is another motivation uh, to get back to film and I got a new Mac computer. So I am happy to be back. So, okay, yeah. Now what this video is about today is Cantu products. I got this in my curl box for January's curl box. I got the Cantu um, Avocado Hydrating Shampoo the avocado hydrating conditioner with coke, avocado oil and shea butter. Um, it's silicone free, um, also free of paraffins, parabens, all the stuff that I don't really care about. It's free of all that stuff. It moisturizes and softens dry, dry brittle hair. So I'm gonna try out the shampoo and conditioner today. And then I also, for my styler, it came with the curl activator. I'm gonna use this as my leave-in conditioner. Um, it's, it looks like it's a cream, it's a curly, yeah, it is a cream. It's a a cream so I'm gonna use it as my leave-in and then I also got the gel which is the avocado hydrating gel flexible hold alcohol free um, so we're gonna be trying these products out today they also did send in a, a dimming brush well it's not a dimming brush it's a Cantu brush and this is this one has fewer bristles in between um, it's fewer, fewer bristles in between than like a, than what a, dim, a dimming brush is. So, you know, I'll see how this does. Give that kind of minute review as well. But yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and go and wet my hair so we can go ahead and get started. Um, this is like a four day old wash, wash and go that just, I mean, it still looks good if I was to style it, but I need to film. So it's perfect time for me to wash my hair. So I'm going to wet my hair and I'll be right back. All right. So my hair is all... Um, wet. I went in the kitchen and wet my hair so it's ready to be washed. Um, I'm going to just section my hair off so I can shampoo it and give you guys an honest review on the shampoo. Alright, so you do get 13.5 fluid ounces of this product um, to put in your hair. So I'm looking for something that gives me a lot of slip, that smells good. This is the consistency of the shampoo. It smells like hmm, soap. It smells like soap. It don't really have a good like avocado smell to me. Um, it doesn't stink, but it doesn't. Oh, I love the sun. It's how it suds up. I do like that. I love a good lather, and it is doing that for me. So you guys know when I wash my hair, I shampoo the. I focus the shampoo on my scalp, and then just let the. Uh, the residual of it flow down the length of my hair. So, the shampoo feels good. I don't think it has a lot of slip for me to be able to detangle with, but it could because I'm not in the shower like I normally, I do wash my hair in the shower. So, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and shampoo my hair and let you guys, I guess, watch. my hair out and I must say my hair feels dry <laughs> I don't feel like I have a lick of moisture in my hair at all so I would say that shampoo is a no-go for me um, I feel like it stripped my hair of its um, oils you know how it can be really stripping and dry and brittle that's how my hair feels right now um, it was not moisturizing like whatsoever my hair feels very 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 brittle um, so I'm going to try to put in this hydrating conditioner and pray that this has a lot of slip. Um, this, there is really not a good, they don't really have a smell to it. 
um, which I mean I guess I don't really mind it. I do like stuff to really smell good, but this one doesn't, and that's fine. I'm just hoping that I'm hoping that I can detangle my hair with this product. That's my goal. I love something with a lot of slip. All right, so my hair has set for a period of time. Let me see if I can get some. My hair does feel a little softer. It does feel a little softer. Let's see. I like to try to see if I can de first de finger detangle, then go in with the actual brush or comb. And I'm able to slide my fingers through it, so okay, okay. All right, so I'm gonna go in with the detangling brush. It starts from the ends and work my way up to my roots. That is the correct way to detangle if you did not know, is to start from your ends, not up here, start from the ends, and then work your way up to the roots. All right guys, so I actually went ahead and detangled the rest of my hair. Off camera, um, I'm not a huge fan of detangling with Demi Brush in the first place, so I can't really give an honest review on this one because I don't like using a Demi Brush or a bristle brush to detangle my hair. I am more of a shower comb type of girl, wide tooth comb, anything like that. I just like the less breakage. Um, so what I did was I detangled this side on camera, but when I went off camera, I detangled with my shower comb, then went through it, went through it, smoothed it through with this one. Um, and I did like that. A lot, but I'm still a shower shower comb girl. I was full, so I had to stop and delete some things, and now I'm back filming. So yeah, back to what I was saying. The conditioner, I give it probably a seven out of a ten. Um, so that's my thoughts on the conditioner. Now we're gonna move on to the curl activator here. This is gonna be my leave-in. I'm going to just take some of this. <clears throat> Seems to be pretty thick product, and apply this. Yeah, it is pretty thick and creamy. So yeah, I'm gonna take this and just apply it to my hair before my hair dries on me. And do this as, like I said, my leave-in. All right, so it was bothering me that this product was just sitting on top of my hair, so I went and got a big spray bottle. And y'all, this is one of our big ones. And I put some steaming hot water in here, dumb of me, into a plastic bottle. So it kind of like re- shaped my bottle so now it's a lot smaller than what it was before all right so now the moment we've always waiting for i had saw kelsey uh the glam twins talk about this gel a while back one of them was saying how great the gel was so i was excited to get this in my curl box so i hope that you know this gel does my hair some good because i'm not feeling like these other products are like hit out the park to me so we shall see um the gel has no smell to it, so it is a pretty, that type of consistency gel. So I'm going to just take it and apply it to section of hair. I can see that it's already weighing my hair down, which is not necessarily a bad thing, um, but it is, you know, a thicker, a thicker gel so maybe it has a, a better a holder a good hold to it so we'll see make sure I get my roots what my hair is looking like I'll show you guys what the back looks like here so around to the other side so yeah so I'm gonna go ahead and let my hair air dry for a couple hours um, start editing this video and then see what my hair looks like you know later on tonight um, I'm gonna let my hair uh, I feel like my hair is way down you know I think I did I think I may have used maybe a little bit too much of this product but we'll see um let my hair dry and i may come back either tonight if my kids let me my daughters especially or um i'll show you guys in the morning what my hair looks like after i have banded it and all that good stuff so 
Stay tuned. Hey guys, so today is the next day and my hair looks pretty good. I was not expecting these results as you guys know and saw that I was very leery, just like not impressed. But I will say for day one, um, it is currently 2.40 and I wore my hair like this to work this morning and I've gotten so many compliments on my hair. the gel today's day one and I am in love I can only see my hair getting bigger and bigger and bigger from here but yeah I'm not gonna ramble much longer thank you guys for watching if you enjoyed this video please be sure to give me a huge double thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel please share this video like this video comment down below I'm so happy to be back and I'm so thankful that you guys still watch my videos even when I go in my A for a little while I thank you for your loyalty and I will check you guys out in my next video. Bye.